thank you all so so much for all of your constant support and your love really really means a lot guys please keep supporting me like comment and subscribe if this reading resonated with you guys and also if you want to book a personal reading with me or if you want to talk about anything i'm always there for you guys and you can talk to me about anything i'm always there for you to express your feelings or your take me as a friend and you can talk to me about anything literally so contact me and all of the details as in the description so let's just begin with today's reading today's reading i will be using some lovers oracle cards for you giving you the universal guidance or the guidance from the spirit guides and angels just let's get into the reading today guys and we will see what else is coming up for you for scorpios so what is coming up my beautiful scorpio sun moon rising and venus signs what is coming up for you guys scorpios and my cross watchers okay these cards are really hard for to shuffle guys anyways very beautiful we have love you would do anything for love we have four of water and we also have the seven of earth all these beautiful cards scorpios i feel like most of you who are um, here right now are very much in a stable spot you are in a stable spot you are ready to uh, give love and take love from others today will be a day of um, you are going to be inclined to share your thoughts or your ideas with others much you're going to be very open with the water energy coming up and i also feel like the messages that you're going to receive from someone from your past is mostly stepping in scorpios which is going to be a little bit messy for you because scorpio you had a um, some kind of a different past and this person's messages can only like you can understand these person's messages it will not make it awkward and you might uh, get some kind of a hidden meanings met for only you and for your understanding from these people okay so it's time for you to follow your intuition <clears throat> there are some kind of uh, things that you notice around you some kind of messages that spirit guides and angels are trying to give you in order to make you go away from a specific situation right and if you follow that things are going to take a beautiful turn for you guys that is what i can see for you my beautiful scorpios and uh, today your intuition will be really high and it's a good time for you to pay closer attention to your dreams because your dreams can be saying a whole lot of things and you need to pay close attention to that maybe for a few of you so what else is coming up for you guys let us find out with your love situation scorpios just one more card or two more cards for your love situation guys what is coming up wow you're going to receive a surprise message or a surprise call from this person whomever you having on your mind they're going to call you this person might be very much interested in you they're very much in love with you they're going to call you they're going to make things right with you okay this is a card that represents a union it is a card that represents action it represents passion you're going to get a passionate call from somebody the conversations are going to be very romantic or something like that scorpio so that is the energy for the day and keep watching because now i will be picking out cards of from this beautiful deck right here for your uh, spirit guides and angel has towards your love situation and what you must do exactly for a few of you you might be confused so that this reading will help you see you guys this is your angel message angel guidance for the day guys we have the pile number one card number one card number two and card number three so take your time to see what decks attract you the most feel free to pause this reading select the deck and choose it because that will give you a detailed insight into what you're going through and what you must do right now at the moment right so card number one i will see 
okay we have the forgiveness stop focusing your past events it's time for you to forgive so for those of you who chose this card it is all this represents that you somebody has done something wrong to you and to move on and to go into your spiritual journey all you must do is you must forgive this person and you must let go of this person start your new life or whatever it may be forgiveness is very much required in your situation if you do not forgive this person if you do not let the situation go with forgiveness then things are really not going to go well for you guys or you will not be able to move on from this situation that has happened right now so it's good if you forget forgive this person forget this person or forgive this person and get back with this person whatever it is a forgiveness is very much required here that is what we have with this card okay now i will be moving on to the card number two we have the embrace so it's time for you to stop complaining and accept the things that has been happening for you and that has happened for you if you accept and embrace things it will really make you happy it will take your mindset into a different level and it will also help you grow on your spiritual journey so no matter what has happened in the past if you want to forget it it's okay you can forget it but just before you forget it try to embrace it completely and then forget it so if you're ex embracing what everything that you've gone through there is no need for you to go through it after this situation okay so for those of you who are not embracing the bad moments as well as good moments it is going to not do good in your future because those of you who are not embracing are the only people who will have a lot of traumas in their life and that will have a lot of influence on your daily activities so it's time for you to embrace and let it go so try to embrace it before you let it go and try to accept certain things in your life before you let it go okay so that is the angel guidance message for you i will be moving on to the card number three now we have the twin flames beautiful so it can be any situation you guys are in a relationship separated seeing someone else third party all of karmic uh things going on in both of your connection with each other no matter what it is guys the person whom you're with is your twin flame the person who you've been thinking about while you clicked on to your reading is your twin flame especially if you uh, clicked on this pile and you're watching this uh, reading for this card this relationship is a divine relationship which is meant for you and this person to come into a divine union and the situation especially if you are in a separation this is a twin flame runner and a chaser stage mm -hmm. maybe you're running behind this person or they are running behind you okay this is called as a runner and a chaser stage and um, do not worry the passion is still there between you guys there are strings attached which are invisible between the two of you and the destiny will bring you both together and you do not have to worry about anything the passion is still there and no matter which karmic relationship this person is in it is something that they will deal with and they will come right back to you because your connection is much more than a comic so you don't have to compare it with a comic okay in case if you're doing that if you're feeling bad and stuff do not feel bad because this person is for you and only for you understand that and you will uh, feel great about whatever is happening in your life guys this is the angel guidance for the day and thank you all guys see you tomorrow bye